All right. I'll make a I'll make a video. I haven't made one in a while. Um, I have been working on the truck. As you can see, battery battery boxes here. I cut the center of the bed out. The tires are close. But that's what it looks like. Um, we are going to work on the truck today. Uh, I got to do brakes, front and rear, and rear wheel bearings because it's they have free floating axles, so it has a hub on it. So I've, I have been tinkering along here. Um, let me show you the inside here. I did finish the steering column. I think that's where I left off. Grab the light. So the steering column's done. It's in, it's painted. Looks pretty good. Shifter's in. Oh, there's my test light. So I got that all done. This is the update on the truck. We'll get back to it. Um, haven't worked on the haven't worked on the fender at all. But that's about it. Um, oh yeah, I moved the switch, the power switch here. So now it's back here. On and off. So that's the update on the truck. And I'll bring you guys back. We're gonna start working on the Dodge. I'm gonna move it over, get the front brakes done, and I'll bring you back when I get the rear. Um, Cause we gotta get the hubs off and put new wheel bearings and seals. The seals leaking on the passenger side. I don't know if you guys remember when I did the turbo and uh, exhaust manifold. Well, I think it's been about a year and the exhaust manifold's cracked now. So I got that going. Um, I have a two piece manifold to put in and I ended up putting a fifth wheel hitch in because I upgraded my trailer. So that went in, there's the brackets, and then of course the trailer. So that got, that got upgraded as well. So I went from a 7,000 pound trailer to like a 13,000 pound trailer. Um, changed my mag high tech pan, so I'm gonna sell that. It was hitting the spare tire. As you can actually you can see it you can see right here I didn't do anything to the cover I just I didn't I don't know I'll show you what I did I bought a different one it's almost like a stock back to a stock design here there it's called solid I guess I don't know but I put that on it's a um, nodular iron this you know but anyway, so that's the update. I'll bring you guys back when I start the brakes, and uh, we'll go from there. I'm gonna get the front, like I said, get the front done. Um, be a separate video on the exhaust manifold. Here it is. It's two piece gasket. There's all the bearings. Um, I'm gonna put a. What am I gonna do? Oh, exhaust brake on it. So I don't have that yet, but that will be a quarter to another video. Anyway, we're about four minutes in. That's the update on the 57. It's coming along slowly. You know, when I have free, free time, when I'm not doing other stuff, um, probably one next to Mr. Heavy Chevy, I probably have one of the messiest, second mess, messiest workbenches. So, all right. We'll bring you back when I'm ready.